This is Rick with Shooter 1721. Woo! Look what we got here. We got the uh, Crossman AK-1. What? AK? That's right. On top, though, I have the center point 1 to 4 by 20 on top. I, yes, I know we could do the open sights. We could do a red dot, but, I, you know, this guy's getting a little bit older. He kind of likes his optics. You know what I'm saying. You can see we got our UTG bipod mount on here. What we're looking at is a 25 round mag. It comes with a speed loader. So it does come with, I don't know if any of you played airsoft, but it comes with a speed loader for the BBs. So you can easily load the mags easily. The mag goes back and the spring in the mag goes back, locks into place. You can easily get your BBs in. That is a great feature of this gun. Yep, it is. Uh, you have to pull the bolt back just like the AK. Got the right weight and feel of an AK. It's, mm, I don't know if it's as heavy, it might be. But um, we set up a target at 15 yards. Remember, it is a BB gun shooting 430 feet per second. It shoots BBs. No pellets, BBs. Okay, well, here we are at the bench for our 15 yard test. That's right, I said 15, not, not 50 yards. It's only shooting 430 feet per second. We got some Crossman Copperhead BBs in here and we're gonna see how she does it at 15 yards. And we got this little optic on here. And let's see how to, see if we can get a decent group out of this. See how it shoots. <laughs> That's not bad for 15 yards. We had two in there that were good, and then we had two high, and then we had that one to the left. But you're probably looking under an inch group there, so I think that's pretty good. Okay, you got to see the five shot accuracy, but I know you didn't tune in just to see the five shot accuracy at 15 yards. You've tuned in to see this, rock and roll. Okay, so we got it on rock and roll. Let's see what we got with the Crossman AK-1. All right. Woo, come on, man. Look at that group. She put the hammer down. <laughs> okay, since we, we walked through and showed you how the gun performs, let's show you a couple features. So here's your mag, right? So you got your mag right here. And then you have this right here. You see that little tab right there? What that is is to remove the cover so you can put your finger in there. Look, the, the cover comes off like this. It just has one tab in there, right there. And then this is where your CO2s are, right here. And then what comes in the mag, okay, is your wrench anyway to all you do is stick it in here and I'm not going to do this on camera there might be a little co2 left in there and uh you just turn that and you can take your co2s in and out and there is um uh, one thing i do recommend when you do shoot bb guns crossman makes power gun oil and just one drop on the head one drop i mean just a little bit on the head of the co2 is good to run through the system that's something we do to keep the seals and stuff fresh i just thought i'd point that out absolutely you can see here where you load your mag you can take it down you can see that you drop your bbs in here they go down here you can use your speed loader which comes with the gun of course i didn't have it along today for the video Woo! Uh, but there you go 25 round mag that's a simple oh oh and then the allen wrench just goes right back in the mag there. I don't know if you can see that. And then you just take this, you stick this back on here, slip it in there, boop, there's your mag. Well, here we are at the end of the video and the Crossman AK-1 is absolutely cool. There's nothing, this is a ton of fun to shoot. Uh, I really liked, as we were in the video, I was like, dang, this one to four little scope on top, it's just a circle with a dot in the center. But I really liked it for this gun. Uh, of course, with the old eyes, you know, I need something if I want to shoot some aspirins. Hint, there's a video coming, so get ready for that one too. But overall, the gun's performance was perfect. It worked really well. Our weather is a little bit warmer here in November uh, than usual, and we thought this would be a great day to do this review. But we know this is splashing. I think it's hitting the market at uh, like maybe around $200, I think. Um, I have no idea what the, the center point runs there, one to four, but we thought we'd put it on here with the bipod so you could get a good look at this rifle. Pretty cool. This is Rick with Shooter1721, having fun shooting the Crossman AK-1. Thanks for watching.